Hello everyone, and welcome back to my Cyberpunk 2077 playthrough. We're in episode 7. Ah, man. Alright, so last episode, we found out that um, Keanu Reeves is uh, taking over our body. So, uh, you know, that's something we gotta deal with. Your haircut sucks. Alright, anyways. Yes, Whoa, most of what we gotta deal with now. Absolutely. No, no, you can't just leave it like that. I mean, shit, he was in uniform. Hey, hey. I've seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Quitting Night City is not as easy as you think. Sort of like an abusive relationship, huh? Yep. He said Listen, uh, I can use a little flow to the old pocket. Want to peek at some fresh gear? Yeah, sure. Sure. Let me see what you got. I may not be able to buy this now, but who knows? Oh, crap. I own this, don't I? I should really learn how these things work. Hmm. doesn't have any bullets in it, but yeah, I'll sell it. Sell this, because I already got it. Sell this one. Wow. Yeah, sell that. Wait, how much is this one? Wow. Alright. Later, dude. Taste the love. Nice. All right. Hello, I'm Arif Iqbal with WNS News. Today is a sad one in our city's history. Mayor Lucius Ryan has passed away. We learned of Mayor Ryan's death from his family. He died peacefully in his sleep. The exact cause of his death. Oh my is God! Look at that. But initial reports suggest coronary implant failure. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be fulfilled by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced plans to run for mayor in the upcoming election. Today, we all mourn the untimely loss of our mayor and dear friend. Ah, oh, shut up. We all know you killed him. You look sketchy as hell. Meet with Takamura. Is that how you pronounce his name? I don't know. Do this at least once every episode. <laughs> right, let me sit. Sit. I was trying to. You do not look so bad. Thank you. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. So, are you gonna eat that? What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn, what's she to you? She and Yorinobu Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. 
thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Hmm. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he getting corporal agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out along with the outcasts easily. Or have you forgotten? Mm. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. For? Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. Mm. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more pawn. Man, I feel like skipping Besides, a bunch of this. And does Hellman. Oh. I mean, yeah, the dialogue is lore, but uh, how, how much of it is, um, you know, necessary for me to remember? What am I this, though? Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did Rude. you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Hmm. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. Oh. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we. All right. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Aunt, you're in. Yeah, much of this dialogue doesn't seem necessary. Anders Hellman, he invented the relic. Yeah, I want to get rid example. of it. He's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman. 
Ah, oh, come on. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Sabro-san to Yorinobu's schemes. Oh, he sneeze. knew both of them well. <coughs> could be an important <coughs> witness. Yeah, Bo bless you, bless you to myself. Hanging by the tail. For se I was quickly. Right. Should take you for a suit? No. Rogues will... I... Hmm. I don't know how much I cannot stay take. here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. All right. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. All right, then. See you around. Oh well, well, well. Zapper dumples and if it isn't, if it isn't, still. City never changes. From Bill and Ted. Oh, is yeah. still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. Who? Leave me the fuck alone. You don't need to speak out loud to talk to me. No. Oh. What do you want from me? Are you still upset about the other night? The hell are you looking at me? Well, I gave it some thought and changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Fuck off, you psychopath. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. Mm. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Where is she, though? You're the ghost of Chris's past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Fine, fine. Or two. Oh crap, I don't have a car anymore. That sucks, alright. I gotta call someone. Hey, who did I call? Oh, Judy. Judy, 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 Judy. Just get shot or what? Oh crap! <laughs> yeah, but just. <laughs> oh man, I should really stop doing that.
Oh. <clears throat> yeah, once I'm finished with this episode, I should really like explore around and uh, learn how to properly play this game. Like, learn all the mechanics. Hmm. Guys, I don't really know how to play it properly. This poor gentleman. How dare you? Yeah, shitty gun. I think it is. Is that David? Huh. What's this? Would you look at that? You see it too, right? You've gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Yeah, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask him both. Seriously, is that David from Edge Runners? Looks vaguely like him. Hello, ladies. Hey! Haven't I seen you here before? You have. Got a good memory for faces. I bet you do. Bar's closed. Sorry, Chief. Hmm. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. No, oh, thank you. That's Just don't let me catch you. I thought that would around, be harder. Okay. Whoa, whoa. Start again. What is it you want us to do? Beat some sense into him. Oh, okay, taking the shortcut. Embarrassing yourself again. Hey, where are you going? Nothing oh, your to business. Think I Why? Stop telling me. 
telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Zeus, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. Oh, all right, so now we can talk. Hello. <clears throat> you just don't give up, do you? Nope. Got nothing. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Can you just answer my question? I'm trying to find Evelyn. That's all you need to know. Better start looking then. Black. Mean. Listen, if you don't know where she is, just tell me. I don't have time for verbal volleyball. Do you know or not? All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find clouds. Look there. And where's clouds? Sig case on my desk got the address. Just take it and go. Thanks. Was that so hard? Mega Tower. Luxurious. All right. Yep. Clouds. It's a dull house. Evelyn, a regular there, or a drone. Yeah. For good Whoa. shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. Mm-hmm. I like her. Gonna need a car. Hey, me. Hey, where do you think you're going? They call me Mr. Uh -uh. Hand. Looking for Pacifica jobs. God damn it. Call me. Name's V. And what? No pleased to meet you? Ah, you ran me over. What the hell? I'm truly honored to meet you. Come you on. got any biz? Call me. Hey. Hey. Nope. Fuck. Out of the car. Ah, bitch. Hey, don't panic. I don't get on one. And there's nobody in it. Come on, let me in. Oh shit, where did you come from? Sorry. Um, there we go. Ah crap, that sun sucks. That turn seemed doubly complicated, but all right.
Akako Akata, the lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find the moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts. You did quite well. You and that friend of yours. Until then. Alright. The way I see it, the only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. Mm. If I miss this time, enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. I think Judy's lying. Called intuition. Oh, so what you meant Ever to say heard of was it? you're full of shit. Got it. Welcome to N54. It's time for your Oh. This place reminds me of uh, that one place from uh, the Dread movie. Uh, you know, Peach, Peaches Grove or something like that. That movie was awesome. clouds where we know what you're looking for would you care to jack into the terminal ah uh, sure all right let's do this this will be a live session so events may take an unexpected turn but don't quit if you feel uncomfortable well wait you could a minute. miss out on something truly remarkable wait what is this place exactly if you feel unready to handle what comes next you can interrupt the session immediately now for your safe word. Um. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Um. Okay, wait, hold on. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes thank you our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky oh wait which one was which again ah oh, come on looking for evelyn parker she work here hmm Give me a moment. Oh, man. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. Well, I'm not looking for a thrill. I'm recording a YouTube video. Come on now. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Uh, personal matter. Uh, I'm sorry, she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. So who will it be, Angel or Sky? Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. Woof. No, seriously, which one was which? Uh, Sky was girl, right? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. Uh -huh. Okay, well, there you go. Don't look at me like that. 
and the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Did the voice just change? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Ah, uh, just uh, how? Clouds oh, only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. <laughs> Okay. All right. All right. Ah. Uh, you know what? I I might do a little editing. So here comes the first cut. All right. Now let's see if there's any anything that I should cut out. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Hmm. Is this where I'm supposed to go? I'm a little lost. No, that's a that's a bending vending machine. Get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. Oh my God. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you here now. You got any idea who I am? Yeah, do you? This conk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what Excuse I can see, me. your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please yeah, stay is that? calm, sir. Yeah, stay We're calm, sir. We're gonna you outside. Oh, no shortage of wise asses. <laughs> yeah, I'm right. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. I need to piss first. <sighs> <laughs> okay. Uh. Second floor is for VIP customers only. <laughs> Where am I going though? It's a Join the down the okay, yet. where though? Let me have my fantasy. Not like you know how to hack it, so I put this shot. Ah, come on. Oh, is this it? Okay, see, now that's confusing. Hi, I'm Hello. Sky. And you must be Vincent? Uh. V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay then. V. Right. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. Oh, uh, excuse me? Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple whoa, 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 question. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something oh, yeah. else. Man, her voice is like right up on my ear. I'm wearing headphones right now. <laughs> Just answer my question. Tell me where Evelyn is. Don't have time for a debate. Why the manager say she doesn't work here anymore? When was Evelyn last here? You know anything. Evelyn had her own story before it collided with yours. But I know you'll find her. You always get your way. Think you know me well? Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. 
say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. I snuffed it once and I'm gonna do it all over again. Got no idea how to stop it. Oi. There. Abby. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. <laughs> Spider-Man. Instead of a dream, you're living okay. a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased. As if you never existed. That's or is it just the vague. fear of becoming someone else? Different. People I've lost live on in my thoughts. Yeah, I'm just gonna go that's right where I'll into be. it. A memory, or just an annoying little voice in someone else's head. You don't see death as destruction, the end. But as a change, that thought alone could save your life. I'm afraid of becoming someone else, forgetting who I am. You're already becoming someone else. Every second of every day. Still, I feel... a connection between who I was and who I'm turning into. What you really fear... is becoming someone you don't recognize in the least. <sighs> so what now? Oh boy. You find out what it is you need to do. Which is... You're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going Oof. where you it's just seeming pretty general. And it won't stop you now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Is it is Not um a single uh, thing in this Is she seriously saying this to me or is this something that she repeats to other people? Else. What's going on? God damn thing threw me out. I need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I, I knew it was I all something fake. wrong. Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own Oof. little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. Well, People there. like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta help me. Please. I'm no threat, but she could be in trouble. Just wanna talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out, and maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Ooh. 
Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody would care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area, booth two, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. Maybe I'll be back. May I see your credentials? Fuck. Hmm. How do I get a VIP? Sir? How do I get out of the RAP access? Sir? <laughs> oh boy. Oh yeah, I could just hack it, right? Have VIP access? I don't know. <laughs> Talk to this guy, maybe? Nah, his VIP access is he got taken away. No, it's the elevator. Okay, what am I doing? VIP access. Grab. Okay, what do you have on you? Ooh, VIP card. Neat. I needed that. Didn't I get it? Hi! Hello. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. Ah, oh, great. 
You sure your VIP card? You need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Hmm. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so... I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kinda like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ah, that's what they should be replacing. Mm. Oh, I got half flares all around me. Well, that's the whole point. They're not supposed to remember, not a smith. Hehe. <laughs> Ah. Technical ability. Can I open this now? Sucks. Nope. Oh yeah, I'm good. Got some new hardware. <laughs> what a cycle! Not motor. A washing machine has a motor. Uh, can we? So, do I go through here or? What was that? What was what? Oh, hey, Jesus. Oh, great. Oh. Oh, come on, come on. Ah, uh, mean. And young, man. Ah, asshole. Oh, I get it. I should knock him out to get the key. Loading screens, my goodness. Oh, come on, come on, almost there. Mr. Forrest, but everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. <laughs> yeah, okay, Mr. Forrest, then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Got no. it. Could it be down. Woodman? Finally, the skull sponges and he's. Ah, shut up. Huh. You really think they remember nothing? Okay, okay. Come on, no mistakes this time. Huh. Grab it. 
You know what? I'm gonna. Motherfucker. Killed me. Take this alcohol and the Bob's your uncle. That's how it's done. No, you saw nothing. Okay, okay. Hello, sir. Right. No clients allowed in here. Be a room and close the door on your way out, would you? Or as you can see, I'm very busy. I can see that. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. Oh, there. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Hmm. Ah, you can do better. Try Roxy over at Booth too. Same heart-shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. <laughs> okay. Wow. You look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho prick who's never been ghosted by his bow or bill before. But go on. I'm listening. You look like a strong and reasonable person. Are you a calm and reasonable person? <laughs> Get it? You've got info, I've got eddies. It's a fair trade. What's your price? You need to pull your head out of your ass. Eddies will buy you whores here, not snitches. Mm. I look like either of those to you. Well... How to look the menu look like here, one. no. You don't look a thing like these meat puppets. More like a Joy Boy's cum rag. You... Insolent fuck! Hey, well, easy there. Hey! Ah. Hey, put the gun down. Well, aren't you the king of fuck-ups? You're not helping. Now what? Oh, come here, Hell, Why don't you just scan the truth from his gray, lifeless eyes? Or... That just my work. Drop. Ah, uh, uh, take all of it. Oh, look at him. Oh, oh what do I do? Oh, I gotta look around. Ah, oh, that's tempting, but... Okay. Inconspicuous. Just act like a regular dude. Did nothing wrong. Oh, great. Okay. Oh, gonna sneeze. <coughs> oh, crap. 
allergies. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Asshole. Ugh. That's a shitty gun. Okay. Oh, balls. Didn't mean to do that. Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toys wet dream. Alrighty then. gonna have to wait until next episode all right so see you next see you guys next week for um episode 8 of cyberpunk 2077 bye bye now